today I am doing my January favorites and I actually have a lot of random stuff to share with you guys but let's start with the makeup. The first thing I want to talk about is this lip stain. It's from e.l.f. and this particular color is called Crimson Crimson. Wait, what is it? Crimson Crush. And it's a very nice reddish color. I've actually had this for quite some time now, but I just recently started using it. And it is amazing. I love the color payoff. It's very pigmented. And the best part is it's only a dollar on their website, which is so great. I have other lip stains from different brands and those range for about $7 to $30, which is pretty crazy. The lasting power is pretty decent. I want to say it lasts me for about one to two hours, which is pretty good for a lip stain. My other lip stains from different brands don't even last me for 30 minutes. So this is pretty awesome. I don't think they sell this at Target, so you might have to purchase it on their website. So I'll link that down in the description box in case you guys are not familiar with the e.l.f. website. So the next product is also from e.l.f. and it's the eyebrow kit. And that's what it looks like. As you guys can tell, I've already hit pan. I think I've been using this for maybe two months now and I have just been really enjoying it. I think the best part about it is that it has wax in it, which is so great. It keeps my eyebrows intact throughout the whole day. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to touch it up or anything. So that's just really great and this is available at Target and on the e.l.f. website. It's only $3 so if you guys haven't tried this out, um, I highly recommend that you guys go out to Target and get it right now. So next is this blush by Benefit. It's called Bella Bomba and it's a really nice pinkish color. Um, oh no, it cracked. Ah, I don't know if you guys can see that. Uh, oh no, I'm so bummed. I think it cracked when I accidentally dropped it earlier. Oh, I'm so... Oh no, now I'm creating a mess. Ah, it's on my bed. Ah, I'm so bummed. But anyways, on the description, it says a 3D brightening pink face powder. I don't really know if people actually use this as a face powder, but I use it as a blush. I actually have it on my cheeks right now, and I just love it so much. It brightens up my face. It gives my face... Um, it gives it a very fresh look, if that makes any sense. Okay, so next is the Snail Polish Remover, and I have been using this for months and months now. I think I've briefly talked about it in my videos, but I've never really gone into full details. But basically, this is a must-have for people who are crazy overdoing their nails, just like me. And it's super simple to use. You just open the top part, and you dip your finger into that sponge, swirl your finger around for maybe five to eight seconds, you take out your finger and the nail polish is gone. It's that simple, it's not time consuming whatsoever. It actually saves you time because it's just, it's so easy and so fast to use and this was only, I think this was only $3. I know at Target or Walmart, it's only $1 to $2. So I highly recommend this, especially if you guys are crazy about doing your nails just like me. So next is this nail polish from Essie, and this is called Lovey Dovey. And I'm not gonna lie, you guys, the only reason why I purchased this is because of the name. I don't know if you guys know this, but my boyfriend Arnold, I call him Lovey Dovey. So when I found this, I had to get it because it's it's him. It's him, right? <laughs> it's such a cute pink color and um, I actually posted an Instagram picture of this last week and a lot of you guys seem to like it. So if you guys are interested, purchase it from Amazon because it's so much cheaper to get it on there. I purchased this for $4 when it was originally 8 to $9. So I'll link that down in the description box if you guys are interested in purchasing. So next is this perfume from Marc Jacobs and it's called Daisy and I am seriously so obsessed with this scent. I'm not very good at describing scents but I'll do my best. It smells, it smells very floral, feminine, just fresh. I don't really know if I'm describing this correctly, but it smells so good. If you guys are ever at Sephora or at Ulta or Nordstrom or something, please do me a favor and smell this and let me know if you guys feel the same way. 
It smells so good. I actually get a lot of compliments every time I wear this. Even my mom compliments me, which is such a huge thing because she's usually very picky with scents, so it's kind of a big deal that she likes this scent. I've also been loving this candle from Bath & Body Works and this is called the Caribbean Escape or the Caribbean Escape, whatever you want to call it, but it smells so amazing. I actually have this burning right there, right now, and the description says tropical melon, raspberry, lemon, creamy coconut milk, and raw sugar cane. It, it's, it smells so good. And right now, I think Bath & Body Works is having their three-week candle sale. So if you guys are interested in picking this up, you need to get it now while they're still on sale because their sales come and go. So um, yeah, I think they are two for 22, I believe. So next is this hair detangler from Victoria's Secret and it is amazing. I've been using this for two months now and it is such a lifesaver. Um, my hair gets tangled all the time for no apparent reason and it's a lifesaver, it works wonders. I think when I purchased this, it was only for $7, but the original price is $14, which is not bad for such an amazing product. So. If your hair is stubborn like mine, use this. It works great and it smells amazing. It smells, it almost smells perfume-like, like roses or something. Next is this hair volumizer by Osis. I think that's how it's pronounced. This is my first time trying out this brand, so correct me if I'm saying it wrong, but I've been using this for two weeks. So far, it's been good. It basically gives my hair volume without having to tease. As some, of you may, as some of you may know, I love teasing my hair and we all know that's very damaging. So um, yeah, my hairstylist recommended this to me. It's been working great. So now on to my favorite books for the month. A lot of you guys had requested me to start adding my favorite books to my monthly favorites video. So that's what I'm going to be doing. And the books for this month are, this one is called Don't Sweat the Small Stuff for Women. And this is Your Best Life or Your Best Life Begins Each Morning. And you guys know that I've been reading this for more than a year now, I think. And this one, I think I've been reading since last year and they're both great books. If you guys are looking for uplifting books, inspirational books, I highly recommend these two. Um, this one is for $13.99 at Target and this one I got for, I think $6.99 at Barnes & Noble. So they're also available on Amazon if you guys are interested. Okay, so now on to my fashion favorites and I just had to go with the boots, if you were watching my vlogmas videos back in December, I pretty much wore these throughout the entire um, throughout the entire month. And while I was on vacation in Singapore and in Jakarta, I would wear these all the time, especially when it was raining, because there were days when it was just raining nonstop, and I wore these non-stop. I am also obsessed with these combat boots right here. These are fairly similar, but this one doesn't fold. It basically has the buckles in the back and this is more military inspired, but I'm also obsessed with these and they're both from Daily Look. I know that, um, I think they're both still available. The last time I checked, they're both still available, but I'll link them down in the description box below. So now on to my favorite song of the month and I know a lot of you guys had requested me to start doing these again, but um, I know I kind of fell off and just stopped for a while just because I wasn't really feeling any songs, but as of late, I have been so obsessed with One Direction. If you guys follow me on Twitter and on Instagram, I'm sure you already know that, but I'm so obsessed with them. They're so good. And my favorite song has to be... Um, it's called Little Things. I think it's from the second or third. I can't remember, but it's from their latest album. And I am seriously so obsessed with this song. So I'm going to sing Liam's part, um, which is kind of like my favorite part. Well, I also like Lewis's part, but I think I like Liam's part more. But yeah, I'm going to sing a little bit of it for you guys. Um, all right, I'm gonna cheat. I'm looking at my phone. 
I don't really memorize it, so. I know you've never loved the crinkles by your eyes. When you smile, you've never loved your stomach or your thighs. The dimples in your back at the bottom of your spine. But I'll love them endlessly. I won't let these little things slip out of my mouth. But if I do, it's you. Oh, it's you they add up to. I'm in love with you. And all these, it sounds so corny when I'm singing it, but I promise you guys, it's an amazing song. You guys have to check it out. I'll leave the video down in the description box. You guys have to see it. It's so good, but Anyways, I think that's about it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you guys have any favorites that you'd want to share with me. Leave it down as a comment or a video response, anything you want. And I think that's about it. I hope you guys have a great day. Oh, by the way, I am going to announce the winners for my Christmas giveaway very, very soon. So please check my Facebook. And um, yeah, that's about it. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.